hello 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 my queens welcome and welcome back to my channel i am kanisha with currency queen budgets in today's video i will be doing a budget by paycheck breaking my paycheck down if that is something that you're interested in stay tuned all right guys so i'm not gonna be on here long i got up a little early um to record this video because i realized that I actually need to get this video out, so I'm going to do this. I'm not going to be, well, I'm going to do this real quick because I got to go to work. Um, but we are going to be using my Budget by Paycheck book, The Diamond Plan. Um, the link will be in the description below, and you guys can go check it out. Go check out my Etsy store and see what else you like on there. So we are going to get into this. Let me get to my correct page. I hope everyone is doing well. All is good on my end. So, guess I need an ink pen. This is going to be for November. Payday is 11 18 22. And I am only pulling for my work check. And I do seven hundred and two dollars. Okay. So I am going to get all of my categories filled in and then I will be right back. Okay, so let's get into this. First, we will start with my bill section. And like I said, I am starting with, um, I'm working with $702. So for my bills, I am going to do, for my credit cards, I'm going to do 30. Um, for my ties, I'm going to do 20. Uh, car note isn't getting anything. Insurance, nothing. Cell phone is nothing. Utilities, I'm going to do 300. Uh, rent is already done. Subscriptions, I don't, I don't, I don't think I'm going to put nothing there. Let me grab my calculator. Okay, so I got 30 plus 20 plus 300. That equals three fifty. Three hundred and fifty dollars. Now what I'll do is I'll go back to my seven hundred and two dollars that I'm starting with, subtract that three fifty, and that gives me three hundred and fifty two dollars that is remaining. All right, I'm going to set this to the side, and then I'm going to move up to my variable expenses. Variable expenses is what you will use on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, so basically, this is what will get me through until my next paycheck, So, or until my next cash stuffing. So my groceries, I'm going to do 100 for gas, I am going to do 75. And a lot of times, this is what stays, it stays the same. Um, So, I really already know what I'm going to put in here, basically. So, it's what helps me get through the week. For spending, I think I'm going to do $10. For household, I'm going to do 20 Medication is five. Um, eating out isn't going to get anything. We've been doing really good. We've been eating at home. Um, so we've been doing real good there. 
And for my copay, I am going to do 15. Okay, so sorry about that. I got a phone call that I needed to take. Um, so we stopped here and let's get this added up. 100 plus 75, 10, 25, and 15. That is $225. So I'm going to take the 352 that we started with, 352 minus 225, and that leaves me with $127. Okay, so we're going to move over into my sinking funds, and I am not going to put anything in YouTube, fam. Um, emergency funds, we are fully funded. That snowball isn't getting anything, so we're going to start with Family Fun. Family Fun will get $5. Self-care, I'm going to do 10. For Beauty, it's, it's 10. Clothing will get 10. Vacation will get 15. Savings, I'm going to do five. Um, car maintenance, I'm going to do five. And for my taxes, I'm going to do 10. And a lot of times my sinking funds stay the same. I keep it, try to keep it in the same um, amount every time I stuff. So... Let me set this up here because you still can't see that. So for my sinking funds, it's getting $70. And then I'm going to take the $127 we had remaining from... Um, my variable expenses and subtract that 70. And that leaves me with $57. So 57 going into my extra savings. Um, for now, I'm going to do her 25. I think she spent all her money. I think. So, for date night, let's do a hot 10. For planners and stickers, mm, I guess I can do 10. And then OES will get 12. Twenty-five plus ten plus ten. Oh, yeah, I'm tripping. Twenty-five plus ten plus ten plus twelve, and that's fifty-seven. And that leaves me with zero. Fifty-seven minus fifty-seven is zero. That is my goal. Um, so I am going to flip this over. And then we are going to fill out my denominations. I'm going to get this filled out and I will be right back. All right, so let's get this part started. Um, for my credit cards, I'm going to do 120 and 110. For tides, I'm going to do 20. Uh, for my utilities, I'm going to do two 100s and two 50s, total to $300. For groceries, I'm going to do a 50 
two 20s and one 10. For my gas, I'm going to do 150, 120, and one five. For my household, I'm just going to do 20. For spending, I'm going to do 10. For medication, is five. For my copay, I'm going to do a 10 and a five. For my family fund, it will get five. For self-care, I'm going to do a 10. Beauty is a 10. Clothing is 10. Vacation, let's do a 1 and a 5. For savings, let's do 5. And 5 for car maintenance. Taxes will get 10. Kanaya, I'm going to do a 20 and a 5. For date night, I am going to do 10. Planners will get 10. And my OES will get 10 and two ones. And then I will go back and count all of these up, which will be two 100s. 50 has four. 20, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Tens, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. For fives, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And for my ones, I have just two ones. So what I will do, I will take this and then I will add this to my cash breakdown. This is not one that I normally use, but this is the one that is closest to me. But I will write these numbers here on here and then this is what I take to the bank. Um, so that is it for this video. Um, but you guys know, let me zoom out a little bit. You guys know that I really, really appreciate you. I hope that you consider hitting that like subscribe button that notification bell and leaving me a comment um but i really appreciate you guys stopping by checking me out all the um love and support that you guys have been giving but you guys know as always i want you to be blessed queenies bye